Hey, what's up there? I'm uh, out on the Monaco searching for tarpon, but they've been elusive. Uh, you stinking fish. I love and I hate those fish all at the same time. But that's not why I wanted to record this and upload this. The reason I wanted to address something with you guys is that I just participated in my first podcast. I've never done a podcast before. I think it's pretty awesome because for about an hour I got to sit and talk about you know philosophy, about the business, about how I got started, why I do what I do. Um, it was a really great, great conversation. And I'm sitting next to the person that uh, <laughs> I did the podcast with. This is Joe Simons, like diamonds. Oh yeah! <laughs> what a fun, fun podcast, man. It was. I uh, I learned a lot about you today, and what's crazy is it was over an hour, and I don't know that mm -hmm. we really even talked about fishing. It was Night. life and and fears mm -hmm. and some things we both had to overcome, and honestly, just really discussing life and, and, and overall happiness and fulfillment it yep. was uh i mean i was hard hitting dude yeah i was kind of getting some goosebumps there a few yeah, times yeah, yeah. and yeah. i couldn't yeah. tell if you were crying or if it was just no. getting hot. <laughs> it was very very hot i think that's what it was <clears throat> you know, big men don't cry right no um it was pretty awesome because uh, i felt a great kinship with joe i think uh we're cut from the same cloth and we have a lot of things in common Plus, I mentioned that I'm a big fan of Salt Strong. Uh, him and his brother have really made an impact in the fishing community. And if you're not familiar with Salt Strong, I suggest you look them up. But also, if you're a fan of me and what I do and are interested in maybe a more personal insight, check out the podcast. So I'll post it on my Facebook page when it's up and all that stuff. So um, I, I think it's worth a listen. And I had a, a tremendously fun time recording it with you Joe so thank you yeah thank you it's uh it's definitely one of my favorite ones and <laughs> I I don't get the opportunity to actually go face to face all the time you mm -hmm. know because we're trying to you know do a lot of stuff with our business and now we have so many thousands of, of customers that we serve in the in the fishing world and um, it's neat to come see someone face to face and you get to see your reaction to stuff and what you're thinking and the mm -hmm. emotions. Yep. Man, it was, uh, it was a really powerful one. I think we could have gone two hours I if, agree. if we hadn't looked at the clock. Yep. But uh, yeah, yep. you guys are going to love this if you've been following Marty uh, like we have for multiple years. <laughs> uh, you are going to learn a lot about this guy and just really the overall journey on how he got there. I thought it was it was pretty fascinating and some really good learning lessons regardless if you're 20 and trying to figure out what's going on in life mm -hmm. or if you're 40 like me <laughs> trying to figure out what's going on in life or yeah, if you're, you're 60, 60 you know trying to figure out like what's what's next what are the next 20 years going to be it yep. was uh it was a really good one man so thank you no it's a pleasure man and and it's uh it's neat to collaborate with some some guys i look up to it's uh yeah it meant a lot to me Thank I was you. gonna say the same thing. I was gonna try to catch a tarpon, dude. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That'd be awesome. <laughs> yeah, the tide's slack, and we're just kind of floating around after the uh, after we did the podcast. So go check it out. I don't think you guys will be disappointed. And they have a ton of other information out there for people who want to learn more about fishing. So uh, salt strong. Give them a look. Pow. <laughs>